and welcome to Longboard Living. We are gripping my brand new full bag. So the first things that you need to grip a board are obviously there's grip tape, a file. What we want to do is grip strips of grip tape. And this is what's going to allow you to make some shape to the board. It's a top mount and for anyone that rides a drop board, really loves riding a drop board because you feel locked in. If you aren't going to move around, this is basically simulating what you would get out of a drop board, but on a top mount. The fact that it's the only grip tape that you can really stack over top of itself over and over and over again. And it very nicely sticks to itself. And it rips pretty easily, so you want to make sure you make use of all these extra little scraps that you put on. All this extra mass that you got at the end that isn't actually used. Just peel it off, stick it onto your new spot. When you're stacking up the grip tape here, you don't want to stack it on top of itself over and over and over again, or else you have a really hard line that isn't such a progressive shape as you go up. You want to stack it up on an angle. Just going to put it down. It's a raised uh, ridge, just like if you were putting concave onto your board. And also it sticks better, layer to layer to layer to layer, instead of right on top of itself. So once you put your last layer down, put a bigger piece so then it covers over the most of it. We want to be very safe when we're doing this. This is vicious. Using our trusty air hanger, let's get the job done, right? Now take care not to uh, break the edges here. You don't want to limit the amount of concave you have just because you bashed it down. For some of the sections are the grip stacked up too high to be able to file down nicely, get out your nice brand new sharp knife and cut down the edges. When you're cutting the grip, keep the blade along the edge of the board, not on an angle like that, not out like that. Just keep it parallel width so you can get a nice even cut and you don't end up cutting into the board. With all these stacks of vicious, it's not so easy, you can get through it. Alright, next step is to slap on your vicious grip tape top sheets. This has been building 3D concave with vicious grip tape at Longboard Lair. Alright, hit me now. Get it.